50th anniversary of Crandon. Man, the history of this place. This is short course as far as I'm concerned. I tell everybody I raised my drivers from seeds and this dirt is what made them grow. 50 years is a long time. It's a long time for marriage. It's a long time for business. And to have off-road racing in Crandon, it's 1,600, 1,800 people to be here for 50 years, and we're still going stronger than ever. It's going to be just a heck of a time in Crandon. I can tell you that. Crandon speaks for itself in that respect. You know, it's been here forever, and a lot of the history has been on the same track that we're racing, so that part's really cool. What an amazing place. I think the first time I came back to Cran was with Walker Evans brought me back in 1989 and just to see everything here is an incredible thing. That's the history that keeps bringing these back, these third and fourth generations of families that celebrate Labor Day here at Cran at the big house. If you walk around the pitch, you could tell it's the 50th anniversary. I mean, it's packed. So many campers, pretty much every single short course off-road racer is here for this 50th anniversary. They're trying to make it the biggest race of pretty much history of short course racing. All the best and the best is here, so. We finally have a race where it can be a world championship. You know, it's always been named that, but is it really? Well, this weekend it is, for sure. It's rivalries, whether whatever sport it is, whether it's your favorite football team, or baseball team, or NASCAR driver. It's those rivalries that build the sport, and this place was built on rivalries, and you're going to see it here. Cranon is the Indy 500, the Super Bowl, you know, of the racing. You know, I'd love nothing more to be here to participate in the 50. A lot of the legends are coming here to watch us 50. Ever since I started racing short course, I've always looked up to all the guys that raced back here and won the cup races and got to hold up that trophy and the wreath around their neck. One of my favorite year back here is when I won every single race that we entered. We won the Pro 2 race, we won the Pro 4 race, then we won the cup race. And uh, that's never been done before. So it's one of those days that you'll, you'll remember for the rest of your life. We uh, were approaching our 200th win and all of a sudden we hit a wall. For 10 races we didn't win one and uh, we happened to get it here. We'd be able to do it in front of all the fans. You know, There's probably 25,000 people here that weekend and uh, to do it in front of them, have them giving us high fives and everything was really cool. It's pretty cool for me because I have a picture. I'm like four years old standing on the fence in turn one watching Walker Evans race here back when my dad was his crew chief. So I feel like Pan was a part of me and the memories I have with my dad as a little kid. So there's so many different emotions than just the biggest short course race ever. It's cool to have everyone here, some new faces, some people that we haven't seen in a long time. I can't wait just to go out there and race and do some battle. It's going to be fast. It's going to be exciting. And nothing can be better than what we got going this weekend right now.